Hey there, Aquarius, and welcome back to Bonnet Cotero. I am here with your Lunar Weekend Vibes. Well, how'd you find that new moon today? I found it kind of sparkly. I felt it kind of, I don't know, felt good. I mean, you know, you may be feeling some trepidation with all of the changes and with all the intense energies that you have focused on you right now, you know, celestial body wise. Um, this is the most intense that it's going to get for a very, very long time. So rest assured that whatever restlessness that you're feeling around this, you may find yourself kind of, you know, chilling out a bit this weekend. Um, you know, let it go. When the, move, when the moon moves into Pisces on Saturday, everybody's going to be lazy. You might as well surrender and enjoy it because you're going to have lots of action, you know, for the next two years. So, you know, oh, geez, did you see that? Okay, what do we get? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Free fallen. Well, look at that. And, you know, it's like, it's like that sensation. I'm going to read it backwards for you today. Um, it's like that sensation um, where, uh, Uh, you know when you toss a baby in the air and they laugh and, and it's like, you know, what is that? What is that? When you toss a baby in the air and they laugh and you catch them and it becomes this little game, but you know, what is that? Well, that's actually fear and trust blended together <laughs> and it produces that joyful, nervous reaction. So, um, you know, that's kind of because you're like a brand new baby, you know, the universe is going to toss you up a couple of times. You got to laugh though. There's no reason to be afraid because you got strength, baby. <laughs> so, you know, you, you're wrestling, you know, your lower natures, like nobody's business right now. Um, you also may have a Leo somewhere that you're working with or in partnership with. But again, you know, I keep throwing to this infinity kind of dynamic. And Aquarius, it's like your higher knowledge is coming in full force. And, you know, it's like you really are operating from a higher place. Your base, um, your base natures may, may spook you a little you know, um, but you're certainly not a victim to them because you are building a new legacy. You know, this is the age of Aquarius and we've got the, the, the seven of hearts. You have so many options in front of you, but this change is not comfortable, you know, because you, you have to make decisions and you're going to second guess yourself over and over again. But ultimately, when you look back on this time, you're going to see this as being a very key point in your life that contributed to whatever it is you're going to be leaving behind. So congratulations, Aquarius. Uh, these energies are quite wonderful. So uh, try to not take things too seriously and enjoy your weekend. And if you did find that this reading resonated with you, please hit the like button, share, subscribe, whatever you got to do, I appreciate. And also check out my website, bonnecotero.com, where you can subscribe and get my newsletter and be updated on the various services that I'll be offering very, very soon. So thanks again for joining me, Aquarius. Have yourself a great weekend. Bye.